Hey guys, it's Andrew from HTC One Softmodder, and today I'm going to be showing you how to convert your, your regular HTC One M8 to the Google Play Edition. Now, this isn't just replacing the launcher and changing a few icons, this is going to make your M8 the full full version of the Google Play Edition. That means it'll include the, the same the stock bootloader and stock recovery that you would find in the Google Play Edition version. Um, because usually most people they want the pure vanilla Android feel because it looks cleaner or they seem more fluid or they just don't want all the uh, bloatware that comes with their um, carrier or by just coming from HTC directly. Now does this require your device to be S off with an unlocked bootloader? So if you haven't done so be sure to do those both of those things. And you also want to make sure that you have USB debugging enabled on your device and that you have ADB and fast boot installed on your computer. Now you're going to have two options when downloading the RUU or ROM update utility. That's the tool that we're going to be using to flash or install the Google Play Edition ROM and firmware. You have two options for that. They're going to be a rooted and a non-rooted version. So just pick the one that you want for that meets your needs. After you have all that downloaded, place the RUU onto your desktop and then plug in your device and open up terminal or command prompt depending on which computer you're using. All right, now that your device is plugged into your computer, you can go ahead and reboot your device into bootloader mode. So to, in order to do that, type in ADB reboot bootloader. Hit enter and then it'll start up ADB and put your device directly into bootloader mode. From here, you're gonna wanna restart your device one more time. So type in fast boot reboot dash bootloader hit enter and then it will reboot one more time this is just to prevent any errors from recurring during the process now you're going to want to boot your phone into RUU mode RUU mode is pretty much like a special recovery and it allows you to flash the RUU files that we downloaded earlier for the Google Play Edition version so in order to get into that mode type in fastboot OEM reboot RUU hit enter and now your device will reboot one more time and this time it will show a black um, black screen with a silver HTC logo on it. After you have your device in RUU mode, you'll want to go ahead and start the flashing process. So in order to do that, you're going to want to type in fastboot flash zip and then the destination of your RUU file that you downloaded. Mine is on my desktop, so I'm going to type desktop slash RUU dash HTC one M8 GE dash one dot zip. Now this is the rooted version, so if you have the non-rooted version, that last part is going to look a little bit different on yours. But after you have that, just go ahead and hit enter, and then it will start sending that file over to your device. You'll know the process went uh, fine if the last couple lines on the on terminal read that it's successful, but in the next line of it says that it's failed. In order to keep the process going, just retype the same line of code as you did before and then hit enter. After that happens, your phone will start the install process of the Google Play Edition partitions and your phone will show a green status bar underneath the um, HTC logo on it. After that, just wait for the process to finish. You'll know when it's, you know it's done when a terminal reads that um, the process was a success. All right, once terminal reads that it was successful and that it has finished, go ahead and re erase the cache by typing in fast boot erase cache. This is just to prevent any boot loops from happening. And after that, just go ahead and reboot your phone. Type in fast boot reboot, hit enter, and your phone will restart. Alright, after your device finishes your booting, you're going to have to go through a setup just like if you've got a brand new phone. But after that, so will have the full vanilla Google Play Edition version of your HTC One M8. I hope this guide helped you guys out. Be sure to check out the full tutorial in the description. And like always, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Have a good one, guys.